Okay, so let's see what's going on here. This is the King of Cups. The Moon. Three of Swords. The Tower Reversed. The Sun. King of Pentacles. Justice. Two of Swords. Eight of Cups. Oh, wow. Okay, you have four major Arcana cards. <clears throat> And you, um, you have a couple of kings, and of course I'll pull the outcome card after the main reading. Very, very interesting. Um, I kind of, when I saw the two kings and I was feeling them out, I said to myself, it feels like a big conflict, um, Virgos, between you and um, another person, your partner, your love interest. And... Um, yeah, and some interesting things going on with your major arcana, which I kind of feel I want to sort of pick apart because you do have the sun here in the middle of your spread. And, um, you know, in this type of spread that I do, yes, the center card is very significant. Um, the sun is just, this is the sun I think the Oracle is saying this is going to be um, just unpleasant situation or event to deal with because when I look at this first row, it looks like someone broke your heart or hurt your feelings or there was a really bad argument. And um, when I looked at the moon, I thought it feels like some of you Virgos discovered someone broke your trust because the moon is about listening to your subconscious. Um, the moon gives morning signals. It, it, it tries to um, give you a heads up about certain things that are happening. And so um, worst fears come true. That's what I felt when I looked at the moon and the three of swords. So in relation to the sun, it's also next to this tower reversed. And... The tower, when it's not reversed, this means complete destruction. But um, when it's in reverse, it's signaling that um, a problem will not be resolved. The tower is, is usually re removing spiritual blocks, removing that which is not good for you, um, spiritual blocks especially. And so um, when I see this tower reversed and this delay, this hold up, someone stuck, someone stubborn, um, someone made a big mess. That's definitely what I'm catching from this road down to here. It feels like the sun is saying, okay, Virgo, just be prepared. Um, a big romantic mess. Someone lied. Someone had uh, been somewhere where they shouldn't. Um, ex-partner issues but it'll come together it'll blow over and so that's when you get your king of pentacles which is the significator for Taurus but once again you're an earth sign and it's always good to have um, a king in your corner okay because the king is about action the king is in control so um, the king next to the sun after this tower reversed it's, it's sort of the oracle saying, Virgo, don't worry, because whatever is happening here from this first row, you're going to um, you're going to figure out what's what and what is this person's problem. Because I feel like some of you are going to deal with a little bit of betrayal, a little bit of confusion, um, and someone dropping the ball. So then you get um, Justice card, the other major arcana in your future. And justice is about doing the right thing. 
and then you get a two of swords which is interesting the justice card is usually very decisive there's no equivocation at all what whatever decision is made that is the decision that stands um, but strangely enough there's a two of swords and the two of swords is about indecision it's about stalling and it kind of makes you wonder well what's going on here well then we get this eight of cups and this is pulling from that energy of the king of cups where I was telling you earlier I felt like there was some sort of duel or conflict between you and an emotionally um, you know fragile person now this is the card of course of moving on for the greater good setting boundaries and healing and um, it's also about the subconscious you know um, I'm definitely pulling this vibe of um, the subconscious is secretive what goes on in our subconscious sometimes it's a mystery it doesn't always come to the surface immediately so in regards to what's going on with your love interest or partner Virgos I feel like there are some deep-seated unconscious issues some of your um, partners are dealing with and you know so when I see this moon and I see um, this idea of danger coming something's going on that you don't know about I feel like this plays out here um, in the future when your interest or your partner says I need a break I need to take some space I'm emotionally confused I don't know what's going on that's why I dropped the ball that is why I messed up that's why I lied that's why you know I did whatever that kind of hurt you from over here and so here are a couple things you should think about Virgo for some of you Virgos um, especially if it's a new relationship um, in the early stages of a relationship there's always that speed bump where someone needs to step back and think things over um, the other thing um, you might want to consider Virgos is that some of you are in an established relationship and um, someone is um, distracted third party or whatever um, they haven't been forthright and honest with you about how they feel in the relationship and so you some of you might want to prepare yourselves for some conversation like I need space or you pinning the person down like why are you acting so passive-aggressive what's wrong with you I don't feel like I have a connection with you so those are some of the things that I see going on I'm pulling an outcome card so with these four major arcana definitely a big shift in your relationships um, but like I said the Sun is very powerful and it's in the center just like the Sun is in the solar system um, you the situation will work out it's just gonna be very rough the outcome card is the nine of swords so yeah I'm getting a sense of worry a little bit of drama someone acting out someone who um, someone who's getting a little careless but I feel like this is not something that um, I feel like it's something that needed to happen towers reversed I feel like once things blow over the tower won't be reversed the obstacles and the blocks that some of you were dealing with not only with the other person but within yourselves I feel like those will start to work out as well so that is your reading Virgo and once again happy birthday I want to say thank you to all my subscribers, new subscribers, and sponsors on Patreon. Thank you so much. And I'll see you next month. And as always, I wish you love and light.